How did I? W you clamped it right there. Yeah, then I the put on my gloves. But a better spot to talk about junk than the crush carrier. Now the crush carrier is something that I got for free from a trailer park because I, I plan on using this thing as a crush carrier. So as you can see, Crush is going through a slight remodeling phase. So everything did like a complete 360. What was supposed to happen was I was supposed to buy something else and then this was going to act as my living space and my crush carrier and things like that, my toy hauler. That deal never went through, so the crush carrier then was pushed on back. Then my grandmother got sick of looking at this gem, so we had to get it off of her property. Here we go, we're taking the crush carrier to the scrap yard. This is what it looks like. You saw what it looked like yesterday. Got the aluminum in the back, nice clean sheets. We got some steel in the front, some insulation right here. But look at the operation. So this was a few months ago. The file says October 12th. I don't know if that's right. Anyways, fast forward a couple months and go a couple hundred miles to the east and then we met up with Jason. You're telling me this thing actually moved? Quite well. Look at this thing, this thing belongs in a museum. So what does the inspection of this consist of? Go in and like, does this thing even have a horn? Yeah. It has a horn? <laughs> That's all it has to pass, right? Pretty much. You got hand signals, you don't even have to, is there turning signals? No. Oh, so it is hand signals? Yeah. I was trying to be funny. <laughs> No seatbelts? No. Really? What the hell is... So, so this is literally like something like you can just get away with doing anything in. Yeah, it's a death sled. <laughs> what the frick, man? So it does stop. This... Okay, yeah, it stops. I have the tiniest holy <laughs> handle ever right here. That's uh, rifle mount. Right. <laughs> rifle mount, I apologize. <laughs> Jason's girlfriend's gonna be pissed, he screwed up the lawn. Believe it or not, Jason, this trailer still holds some sentimental value to me. We had some good times at this thing. <laughs> now it looks a little different from when we picked it up, but it's still, she's cherry. I still can't get over how nice the wheels are, I think. Uh, the trailer is a 94, is the trailer 94? Or, or 92, something like that. The tires are brand new. The tires are brand new. Yeah, I bought them. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, they look, they look mint. Remember I had to clean up the two wheels that you burnt? Oh, okay. And then we took them to Chris's. Okay, I, I thought since they had like the siding on them, maybe it protected them from the sun and the, the no. tires are nice. No. Okay, so the, those are new tires. Okay. Yeah, it, it's, it's been a while. So what's the plan? <laughs> Definitely killing it on the plan right now. The plan was to come out here and do a little something with the old crush carrier so that it can finally carry something and hopefully maybe one day carry crush. Uh, we are going beyond the Call of Duty. We've already tore it up in the Jeep. Okay, yeah, it's not. Cut that back part off and um, welded our first mounts on here. And now we're already getting ready to hang the new axle stuff. All right, Jason, I just gotta plug in my phone real quick. Are you excited to hang the new axle stuff? Oh, we're getting started, aren't we? Mm. 
mis miscalculation here. Jason, wait a minute. Wait, why are you unplugging that? We don't we don't need that grinder. Why do we need a grinder? I just got done welding the last thing. Yeah, well, you welded it in the wrong spot. But. How did I? W you clamped it right there. Yeah, then I the put on my gloves. We're not done welding the axle like I thought we were. When I originally got this thing, it was designed to haul crush and then like have living space for the race and stuff. Um, something I haven't mentioned. I think Jason just broke my... Oh, my haven't seen a lot of crushes they actually discontinued the racing of these TVs there's no more racing I don't know if it was too sketchy or if what happened he keeps on breaking myself the blade is doing this now that's supposed to be on that wrapping up for the day and I'm sorry to say and I'm sad to say we lost something very near and dear to my heart that made these three machines productions possible that's the helmet it, it it's shot it's garbage you gotta pick your garbage <laughs> after the memorial service of the helmet we uh, Jason's got an interesting shower on off. What the? This. <laughs> Do I? I only need an engineering degree. On off, hot, cold, and uh, selector. Well, can you repeat that one more time? And then this is really random, but we got some dinner. I like to snack. Day two is not being as nice to us. Trailer really looks good though. How about we turn on the gas? Yes. How nope. about we tighten up the gas? So we went for a small illegal test spin. We took, I think it was a 32 foot trailer, if I'm not mistaken, 32 foot, 35 foot, shrunk it down to a 16 foot trailer. Jason's going to use it and he's going to finish it so that we can haul it like the Jeep, uh, crush, stuff like that. And also last Sunday was Mother's Day and I hope you guys, I hope you mothers had an awesome Mother's Day. Nothing says happy Mother's Day more than a brand new lawnmower. That should make it home, right? I'm happy to say that the mower made it, and it made my mother extremely happy. I hope you guys also, like my mother, are very, very happy, and click that like button in the that, down there. It's usually below the video, somewhere around this vicinity. And if you want to keep up with me when I'm not on YouTube, because I'm uploading only on Tuesdays right now until I get my stuff in order, follow me on Instagram. I just gave away some Nitro Circus tickets, so it's worth a follow. Stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. Until next time, 3D Machines out. You had me at hello. Oh, baby, yeah.